Imagine a book so mysterious that even the best cryptographers in the world can't decipher it. This is the story of the Voynich Manuscript, a 15th century codex that continues to baffle experts to this day. Its origin and purpose remain shrouded in mystery, making it a fascinating subject for scholars and cryptographers. This perplexing artifact stands as one of the most significant unsolved puzzles in historical and cryptographic studies. In 1912, Wilfred Voynich, a Polish-American antiquarian with a pension for rare books, stumbled upon a manuscript in the Villa Mondragone, a Jesuit college in Frascati, Italy. Among a trove of ancient texts, this particular book stood out, its cryptic script and bizarre illustrations hinting at secrets waiting to be uncovered. Key individuals involved in its early examination included cryptologists and scholars like William Romaine Newbold and John Matthews Manley, who embarked on initial attempts to decipher its cryptic contents. Their efforts marked the beginning of a century-long quest to unravel the secrets of this enigmatic codex. The Voynich manuscript is a vellum codex, approximately 240 pages long, with dimensions of 23.5 by 16.2 centimeters. The pages are made from high-quality calfskin parchment, exhibiting a remarkable preservation of its medieval craftsmanship. The manuscript is bound in limp vellum with tattered edges, indicating extensive handling over the centuries. Written in an unknown script, the text flows in a cursive style with roughly 170,000 characters, using an alphabet of 2025 distinct letters. The script runs from left to right, occasionally punctuated by star-like and flower-like glyphs. The manuscript's content is organized into various thematic sections, each filled with vivid and intricate illustrations. The herbal section features detailed drawings of unidentified plants, accompanied by the mysterious text. The astronomical section contains diagrams of celestial bodies, zodiac symbols and star charts. The biological section shows human figures, often female, immersed in what appears to be a green fluid, connected by elaborate tubes. The cosmological section is filled with complex foldouts, depicting circular diagrams and possibly maps of unknown realms. The pharmaceutical section illustrates apothecary jars and parts of plants, while the recipes section lists numerous paragraphs of text, possibly instructions or alchemical formulas. Each section adds to the manuscript's enigma, presenting a blend of artistry and mystery that has intrigued scholars for decades. Theories about the origins and purpose of the Voynich manuscript abound, reflecting the manuscript's enigmatic nature. Some scholars suggest it may be an elaborate hoax, created to baffle and intrigue. Others propose it could be an unknown or constructed language, possibly a cipher or code. Various hypotheses point to medieval alchemy, suggesting the manuscript contains hidden knowledge about medicinal herbs, astronomy, and alchemical processes. Another popular theory is that it was intended as a medical reference book, illustrated for teaching purposes. Over the years, numerous experts have attempted to decode the Voynich manuscript, employing various methods and technologies. In the 1920s, William Romaine Newbold claimed to have deciphered it, suggesting it contained advanced scientific knowledge, but his methods were later discredited. In the 1940s, Joseph Martin Feely and Lionel Strong proposed different decryption approaches, yet their findings lacked consensus. More recent efforts, including those by military cryptographers and computer scientists, have used sophisticated algorithms and machine learning. Despite these efforts, the manuscript's text remains undeciphered, each failed attempt only deepens the manuscript's mystique, fueling further speculation and investigation. Modern technology has significantly advanced the study of the Voynich manuscript. High-resolution imaging and multispectral analysis have unveiled hidden layers of text and illustrations, previously unseen by the naked eye. Carbon-14 dating places the manuscript's creation between 1404 and 1438, confirming its medieval origins. Digital tools and machine learning algorithms have been employed to analyze the script's patterns, attempting to find linguistic or cryptographic keys. Contemporary theories continue to evolve, with some researchers suggesting the manuscript may be written in a lost or constructed language, while others argue it could be an elaborate cipher or an example of medieval glossolalia. Recent studies propose that the text might encode natural language through an unknown method, or it could be a sophisticated hoax. Ongoing research involves interdisciplinary collaboration, combining cryptography, linguistics, and historical scholarship. Institutions such as Yale University's Beinecke Library 
which houses the manuscript, and independent scholars worldwide persist in their efforts to decode its secrets. Despite technological advancements and extensive research, the Voynich manuscript remains an unsolved enigma, captivating modern science and mystery enthusiasts alike. The Voynich manuscript has left a profound mark on popular culture, inspiring numerous books, films and artworks. Its mystique and the quest to decipher its contents have captured the imaginations of both creators and audiences. The manuscript has appeared in novels such as The Lost Symbol by Dan Brown and in TV shows like Warehouse 13, where it is often portrayed as a key to unlocking ancient secrets. Graphic novels and video games have also drawn from its enigmatic allure, incorporating it into their plots as a symbol of hidden knowledge and mystery. As a historical and cryptographic enigma, the Voynich manuscript has garnered significant attention from scholars and amateur cryptographers alike. Its undeciphered text and mysterious illustrations have made it a subject of fascination and speculation. Conferences and publications dedicated to unraveling its secrets highlight its status as one of the most perplexing artifacts in history. The manuscript's enduring mystery continues to challenge our understanding of medieval knowledge and cryptography, ensuring its place in both academic circles and popular imagination as an icon of the unknown. The Voynich manuscript remains an enduring mystery, captivating scholars and enthusiasts with its undeciphered text and enigmatic illustrations. Despite extensive research and technological advances, its origins, language and purpose are still unknown. This cryptic codex continues to inspire curiosity and debate, highlighting the limits of our historical and cryptographic knowledge. Its significance lies not only in its content, but also in its ability to intrigue and challenge our understanding, securing its place as one of history's most fascinating enigmas. If you're intrigued by the mystery of the Voynich Manuscript, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more deep dives into history's greatest enigmas. Hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. What do you think is the secret behind this cryptic codex? Drop your theories in the comments below.